without power as storm hits Russia, Ukraine. Hurricane force winds coupled with heavy rains impacted electricity supply, leaving millions of people in Russia, Ukraine, and occupied Ukraine without power on Monday, November 27. The rains and the wind caused flooding in many regions. More than 2,000 towns and villages affected in Ukraine. Ukraine's Interior Ministry has said that more than 2,000 towns and villages in the country lost power due to bad weather. The Ukrainian mainland was lashed by up to 25 centimeters, 10 inches, of snow. In total, 2,019 settlements in 16 regions are cut off from the grid, Ukraine's Interior Ministry said. Authorities in Odessa, a city in southern Ukraine, said that 1,624 people people were trapped in snow and had to be helped. The city has often been target of Russian strikes since its invasion of Ukraine in February last year. Temperatures in the region have fallen below zero and there have been reports of winds gusting up to 72 km an hour. Situation in Russia and Occupied Ukraine Videos on social media showed huge waves crashing on Russian coasts of the Black Sea. Wind speeds reached over 140 km in some places. Reports in the local media said that there were at least four deaths. Russian state media reported that two bodies were found in Krasnodar region. A sailor was killed in Kerch Strait between Russia and Crimea. Oleg Krichkov, an advisor to Russian installed Crimea governor Sergei Aksyonov, said that one man was killed in the Russia annexed region. The man went out to look at the waves and, unfortunately, tragically died, said Krichkov. According to Russian energy minister, about 1.9 million people in Russia were affected due to power cuts. This mainly included population in southern Russian regions like Dagestan, Krasnodar and Rostov and also occupied Ukrainian territories like Donetsk, Lugansk, Kherson, Zaporizhia and Crimea. The Russia-installed governor of Crimea Aksyonov said that efforts were on to restore electricity in next two days.